is, but you never have any duty to intervene on behalf of somebody else. Concealed carry classes continued as scheduled Saturday morning in McAllen. You need to be able to tell the police or you need to be able to tell a judge. Among the topics, the justifiable use of deadly force. Texas really is um, such a gun-friendly state and the laws allow pretty much anybody as long as they can pass the background check and take the course to get the gun. Vocal groups like the Brady Center to prevent gun violence are hoping to change that. They've started an online petition to advocate for tighter gun laws following Friday's shooting in Colorado. I don't think it's going to have a major impact on us here. But CHL instructor Jonathan Ball says it's an uphill battle. He says the high-profile shooting in the Trayvon Martin case will likely have bigger implications instead. Where I see the debate going is more geared towards what happened in Florida and whether we're going to have to start relooking at issues of stand your ground laws. Ball says he's had many calls about his concealed carry classes before Friday's shooting. He's expecting many more in the days and weeks to come. In McAllen, Rafael Carranza, Action 4 News.